Hello everybody and welcome back. We find ourselves at the Lego store which is located in Disney Springs in Orlando, Florida. Today we're going to be checking out the entire store which features some magnificent custom Lego creations. The Lego store found in Disney Springs is actually just across the way from the World of Disney store. Here we can see the front entrance, which is uh, right out front of this magnificent display of the Maleficent Dragon. And you can see that it is quite busy here today. The main entrance features the Kids Activity Center, in which you can build many different things. And you can actually race cars down the track here. So I've made my way to the other entrance that services this Lego store in which you can see a picture which is made of all Lego bricks and then one of the newest sculptures which is found right inside the entrance and we can see it is Darth Vader. Right across the way from Darth Vader, we have the Incredible Hulk. So there's been some changes made to the LEGO store since I was last here in September 2018. We can see that we have a whole bunch of LEGO bricks right here. And we can see the sign in behind saying, pardon our dust. And also this display right here. Now the two displays used to be home to some Snow White and the Seven Dwarves LEGO creations. But I imagine they are going to be cleaned up and replaced or maybe something new is going to go here. One display that still remains intact is the Toy Story display where we have Buzz and Woody and RC. We can see that the base of it is constructed using uh, larger Duplo bricks. An absolute massive display that consists of 120,000 bricks and weighs over 1,520 kilograms and took 1,580 hours to construct. But even when we look at this display, you can see that some of the bricks are starting to weather. And I'm curious to know if they're going to be redoing this one in the near future as well. And there's also a uh, Friends display here at the Lego store in downtown Disney. This Lego store is absolutely massive. I believe it is one of the Keystone Lego stores of the world. It features so many different displays, every different Lego set, and also lots of different activity centers as well. The pick-a-brick wall in this Lego store is quite large. And what's very cool about the pick-a-brick wall, there's actually an employee here who makes custom lightsabers out of pick-a-brick pieces from the pick-a-brick wall and then he offers to sell them to customers just for the cost of the bricks. So I can actually get these lightsabers here, either the green or the red, for $32.95. He also makes the Kylo Ren lightsaber and the Darth Maul lightsabers when he has enough time. So they're operating a programmable Lego set, which can be operated from an iPad. Taking a look at the featured Star Wars sets, we can see the new Tantive 4, which was just released on May 4th. And with any LEGO Star Wars purchase over $75, 
you're gonna get the mini AT-AT Walker from the Battle of Hoth 20th anniversary set. It's gonna be hard to capture everything in this LEGO store just because it's so busy. It's really hard to get a clear shot on anything. Uh, but the store itself is, is absolutely huge. It's got an amazing pick-a-brick wall with uh, like hundreds of pieces uh, that I would never find in your average LEGO store pick-a-brick wall. It also has pretty much every LEGO set that's currently available from the LEGO group. And it's got some amazing sort of play stands and stuff like that. Things where you can, where kids can create custom things and sort of play around with all the different Lego bricks available. Not only that, but it also has uh, a lot of different displays that uh, shows off some of the best Lego sets. And also has the custom creations like the Hulk and Darth Vader and Maleficent and Toy Story and everything like that. So it's pretty awesome. It's definitely one of my favorite things to do when I make my way down to Orlando, Florida is just to check out the Lego store at Downtown Disney. It's super duper busy and hard to get a good video, but it is what it is. I really do appreciate the view today, guys. Make sure you uh, give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and we will see you guys soon in the not so distant future. Bye for now.